I chose a uh, lockdown two to have a month off beer. It was, it was a good idea, wasn't it? So here we are. I'm sampling the delights of the alcohol-free world. <clears throat> Uh, and it's brought us to this. So, uh, today I'm drinking an alcohol-free Hefeweizen from a Good Karma Beer Co. Called, love that feeling. So, Hefeweizen, wheat beer, vice beer, whatever you want to call it. That style is kind of my favourite of all time, it's what got me into beer. So when I saw this a few weeks ago, when I knew I was going to have a month off the booze, it kind of made sense to like, take the plunge and buy a few cans and I can look forward to something <laughs> over this month. Anyway, good Karma Bruco. Seems to be doing good things as well, uh, which is always, always, always a plus when you're buying beer. If the brewery behind it is kind of pushing for, well, we'll read the can, this is what we're pushing for. So uh, we are part of the mindful drinking movement with equality, diversity, and sustainability at its core. I'm down with that. He, he wasn't down with that, unless you're in Nobbed. I always read AF as, as fuck, so. Just a little, just a little quirk of mine. It looks like a Hefeweizen. If I saw that in a glass from some uh, German bottle, I'd be, I'd be kind of happy with that. Three fingers foam, pure white head. A bit of that herb in, herb on us, but it's mostly like, kind of orangey nose to it. Mm. So with like Hefeweizens, I want like, the, 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 the ones I, for like big on banana, big on bubblegum, stuff like that. It's got an initial like banana hit to it. Obviously the body's probably not as thick as you would probably see on like 5% of vaccines, but there's enough there where you can enjoy it. Because I haven't got a table, so I've got to hold it like this, like I'm a fuck, like who the fuck sits a bar like this, but because there's a fucking camera, it's a small angle lens, you got to fucking do it. Sorry. Yeah, kind of tropical. If anything, it kind of tastes like um, the Schofferhofer grapefruit. Bit of lo lots of fruit on it, but yeah, I've got that like kind of backbone where bit of herbal, bit of a hoppy taste, but not over over the top. But that that kind of fruit <coughs> overrides anything. So yeah, I'd say it's, to me, it tastes more like a Schofferhofer grapefruit type thing, which is obviously not a bad thing. I guess if you yeah, if you if you if I drank it blind, I would just say it was like. A Rattler of based off of a wheat beer. Yeah, there's, there's a nice like full bodiness to it on the back, which makes it really Moorish and really enjoyable to drink. Actually, I guess I'm getting a bit more maltiness now on it. As I've drunk more like the it's getting a bit more syrupy, a bit more sweeter on the end. Um, but it's a free for milk can. You know, it's, I can't see any problem with down that and uh, asking for another one to be honest. But yeah. Good karma beer co. Try and see good things with beer, alcohol free beer. Everyone needs a good alcohol free beer in their life. I'm very happy with this. I know there's a few breweries now that just kind of do alcohol free stuff. Is there anything you prefer that you'd like to tell me about? Drop us a comment and a like and a subscribe. Cheers. I'm bloody miserable actually. Bubs are shut. What do you expect? <coughs> <coughs> Ugh.